baby. Listen to this. Okay. Got them air full screens with them air full screens. Got them air full screens with the J's on the bottom. Got them air full screens with the J's on the bottom. You see them? I got them with the J's on the bottom. What up, my kings and queens? Welcome back to the kingdom. It's your boy, Kings I 23 Kicks. I'm here to drop a quick video for y'all, man. Got a quick little pickup, a little something, something for y'all. Um, as you can see, still stuck on the computer, still stuck in the office, still out here grinding, still here making it. But I gotta get a video out to y'all, man. In today's video, got a little unboxing of y'all. Um, y'all see what that is. Y'all see what that box is. Matter of fact, wait a minute, thumbnail? But before we get into this box, hey, I'd like to say thank you to all my subscribers. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you haven't hit the notification bell, make sure you hit that bell so you get notified of all the videos that I drop for you guys and be part of the kingdom. You get what I'm saying? And for anyone that is new to the channel, I greatly appreciate you guys for subscribing. Make sure you go back, check out my other videos, go back to my archives, check out my other videos, like, comment, subscribe on those. And then if you haven't subscribed, make sure you come over there, hit the subscribe button and be part of the kingdom as well by hitting that notification bell. But today, I'm going to give it to y'all the way it is. Y'all know me. I'm going to keep it a buck. Early little look at the Jordan 1 Obsidian guys, man. So... They do release tomorrow. Um, there's a lot of people I already know. A lot of people is getting uh, confirmations. I actually got another confirmation today through Foot Locker. Um, and so, your boy's going to actually double up on these things, man. The crazy part about it, I wasn't even sure if I was actually going to hit on the Foot Locker app. Um, so, I had to hit up one of my partners. One of my little plugs, and I had to get the shoe. Um, to be honest with y'all, man, just looking at the shoe, this is this is a. The thing is, I, I really want to know what makes a shoe hype. You know what I'm saying? Why do people go hype? Why do people go crazy over certain shoes, certain uh, colorways, over certain silhouettes, or whatever? What? is it that makes a shoe hype is it because everyone wants the shoe everyone likes the shoe or is it just a dope colorway what is the, what is it that makes things hype um and the reason why i say this is because this guy right here is supposed to be like the hype of the year this is supposed to be the jordan the hottest jordan one of the year and being honest with you i was feeling the shoes as soon as i seen it i mean i'm a fan of the North Carolina baby blue Pantone colorway, however you want to put it. And that's the reason why I liking it. That's why I was liking it. That's why I was feeling the shoe. Not a fan of Navy, but it's enough baby blue in here to where I was like, you know what, I'm going to grab that. And I like Jordan 1s, um, just to be honest with you. But this, with this sale colorway, you know, Jordan's been going crazy with the sale colorway this year. Um, and on this one, I must say, I like the sale on there. It's 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 pretty nice. It's it's nice, man. The sale on here and the and the leather, this tumble leather on here. It's it's soft and buttery, man. I mean, it's it's that's soft, man. That's real soft and buttery checking that out you know what i'm saying so i mean you have the navy going around the toe box the toe that sailed around the toe box your tongue sail color i don't know i actually like the sail on here um i'm kind of glad it wasn't like a white white um but i like the sail that is on this shoe um of course you know you got your navy wings logo your upper and this is this is this is a fire shoe to be honest with you is i mean this the leather on here is so soft man it's it's 
it's kind of comparable to the shattered backboards. It's not shattered backboard soft quality, but it's 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 real soft, real soft in. I'm, I'm I'm feeling the shoe. Um, of course, you know you got your your inside and your sizing tags off in there. I'm just, I'm just over here messing up the shoe. I'm probably gonna need to do it on foot. But being I'm in the office, I'm actually on break. I'm trying to make this video for y'all while I'm on break. Uh, I'm really feeling the shoe, man. Of course, you know, you got your navy or obsidian uh, with the baby blue Nike Air on there on the tongue. This is a fire shoe. Um, and to be honest with y'all, this is... I've been thinking about this. Y'all know I miss the rock, don't stop. But at the same time, I mean, everyone in this world is pretty much a capitalist. So this is actually going to be a shoe that I'm doubling up on. I'm definitely going to go pick my other pair up tomorrow. And I'm actually going to stock that shoe. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I actually want to see if the prices are going to go up uh, like everyone says that they're going to do. Um, this is the reason why I'm doing that. Um, I do a lot of research. I do a lot of, uh, you know, looking at stuff and making sure going online and um, basically just, you know, checking prices and see what's going to be, you know, profitable or whatever the case may be. So I do a lot of research, man. Um, and if this is going to be a hype shoe like everyone is talking about it's going to be, I'm actually going to, I'm going to sit on a pair of these. So the pair that I am picking up tomorrow at Foot Locker is going to be my size 12, just like this one is my size 12. And we're just going to see what these Obsidian guys are going to do. I'm going to do, it's going to be a little bit of research. So I just want to see what is the hype going to be? How long is the hype going to be? Is the hype is going to drive the price up? And if, you know, if the price goes up to where, you know, I can no longer sit on them. Guess what? I'm actually I'm a seller pair. We're gonna see. I'm not one for selling my shoes, man. Um, I got shoes all over this house. Dead serious, dead ass. I mean, my sneaker room, my office, bedroom. I mean, this is not even including like my LeBrons, my Pumas, you know, Reeboks, all of those. Like I rock all those type of shoes, man. Adidas, everything. But. I just want to see how this shoe is going to do. So, I mean, comment down below. Let me know, did you guys get these, man? And uh, y'all comment down below. Let me know what is the hype. What do you feel like? What makes a shoe hype? You know what I'm saying? What makes a shoe hot? Is it maybe the artist that is tied to it, like the Travis Scott? Or, you know what I'm saying, the Drake? You know what I'm saying? You got Drake shoe. They're signed with Jordan, but, you know, Drake. Is it because it's a Drake shoe? Is gonna make it hot. Is it the artist that just makes it hot? You know what I'm saying? Or whoever's tied to the shoe, like Off White. You know what I'm saying? Virgil. Is that what makes it hype? You know what I'm saying? But anything that's not tied to a shoe, well, let's just say a shoe is not tied to a famous, a famous person or a celebrity or whatever. What makes the shoe hype? What drives the prices of the shoe up? The stock, you know, the shoe stock market. That's what I'm wondering, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I sit back and I watch a lot of these uh, stocks and videos and do a lot of research and just wondering what makes it hype in your opinion. For me, I think, I mean, if I'm Nike, if I'm just going to be 100% honest, keeping it a buck with you, if I'm Nike, I'm going to drive the hype up some kind of way. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to drive the hype up, drive the prices up, and it is what it is, but that's just me. So, these are definitely getting the crown of approval. There's no clown in here. These get the crown. These are definitely going to be in the kingdom, going to stay in the kingdom. And uh, y'all let me know if y'all going to cop these days, man. Y'all let me know if y'all going to cop these. Because this is, this, is this is a nice pair, man, to be honest with y'all. And I can't wait to pop these bad boys out. These... Yeah, I can't wait to, to rock these bad boys. I don't know where I'm going to rock them at or when I'm going to rock them, but um, I can't wait to actually un-DS these. And it's not just because I got I know I got another pair. It's just 
I love to rock my shoes, man. I love to step out of here, step out the house with the heat on. It is what it is. So, there you have it. The Obsidian Jordan 1. Y'all let me know if y'all grab these things, man. If you plan on grabbing these or, or maybe you just passed on them. I know some people that don't even like Jordan 1 silhouettes. They like other silhouettes. You know what I'm saying? So, Y'all let me know what y'all grabbed out there. Let me know how y'all feeling. Comment down below. And as I always say, my kings, stand up. Rule your kingdom. And for my queens, make sure you stand beside your king. And always remember, it's always the right time to do the right thing. Peace. Where's stressing me? Coming to the bottom, moving straight to the top. Yeah. Coming with the pull up to the number one spot. Yeah. Pushing my rap, try to push out on the block. Yeah. Holding my ground, so I rappers get lost.